Hey everyone, Jose here from today, and today we're doing a fun little experiment with the new Victus 16 by HP. And as a tech reviewer, multitasking is a skill I needed to learn given the fast-paced environment. I know our teachers or parents might have told us to focus on one thing at a time, but you know, that's life. And with multitasking, sometimes it's easy, but when things get extra difficult, I rely on certain tools to help me clear my plate and save my sanity while I'm at it. Today, we're taking a look at how the new Victor 16 by HP can help me multitask with ease by putting it to the test. A stress test of that. Can it keep up with my demands without crashing or lagging? Well, roll that OBB and let's get started. First things first, let's talk a little about the Victus 16 and how it differs from its predecessor, the HP Victus 15, which we featured in another video last year. By the way, if you want to check out that video, you can watch it here first. Compared to the Victus 15, the new Victus 16 is of course larger with a 16.1 inch display, which has slimmer borders compared to before. It also boasts a bigger battery at 70 watt hour. You also get the latest 14th gen Intel Core processor under the hood. Not to mention, you get multiple I.O. ports for everything that you will be plugging in. Specifically, you get three USB-A ports, a USB-C port, that's also a Thunderbolt port, a full-size HDMI port, a LAN port, and even a 3.5mm audio port. Now, as I mentioned earlier, being a tech reviewer means always being on top of the latest news when it comes to tech. More importantly, I have to be ready to work anytime, anywhere, with all of these new models, smartphones, tablets, and updates coming in left and right. It means that on any given day, I have the following up and running, well, at the very least. I always need my browser for reading articles and watching launches, news, and other product features, Microsoft Word, and of course, the full Microsoft Office suite to write my notes and drafts. Of course, I also need music playing, maybe, or even have a show or movie streaming on the side to keep me entertained. It does get boring after all and sometimes and I need my entertainment when I'm working. So as you can see, multitasking. And as you can see here, the Victor 16 has no problem handling multiple programs open because the Intel Performance Hybrid architecture of Intel Core i5 processor 14th gen leverages on performance cores to optimize performance in handling all your needs whether they may be for productivity like what I'm doing for now or gaming, which of course you can do. This is a Victus laptop after all. Meanwhile, efficient cores or e-cores take care of all your background tasks so you can keep working without interruptions. The Intel Thread Director works by distributing your workload to either P cores or e cores so you can write, browse, chat, stream, play, and more with ease. I mean, you can pretty much do anything you want all at the same time. It even comes with Intel Turbo Max Technology 3.0 frequency that allows me to prioritize my workload by giving me the boost needed. And of course, the Victor 16 runs on Windows 11, which is the latest OS release from Microsoft that boasts a faster performance as well as new features to boost productivity and creativity, among many other features. And as well, you do have Copilot. And even though I might not be gaming right now, I am still pairing the Victor 16 with HyperX peripherals, such as the keyboard, the mouse, the desk mat, and headphones. Now, let's add another task to see how the Victor 16 will handle the pressure. I'm gonna open Adobe Premiere to start editing and eventually render a new video in 4K on top of everything that I'm already doing right now. So far, the Victor 16 is still performing quite well with the heavy added tasks. No lags, no crashes still, which I'm sure is due to its powerful Intel Core processor. It also helps that the Victor 16 now has an upgraded cooling system, which helps it power through the entire rendering process. The Victor 16 also boasts a 144Hz refresh rate and, as I mentioned earlier, 16.1-inch Full HD display, which allows for smooth playable video previews on Premiere, making my work a lot more efficient and not to mention easier. I can also hear everything clearly thanks to the speakers that are tuned by Bang & Olufsen when I'm editing and when I'm listening to music. That's, of course, if I'm not wearing my headphones. For our final test, I'm going to go on and add one more task on top of everything that's already going on. This time, I'll be doing a test upload of the video I just made. I know it's not the best video, but I mean, that'll do. And of course, we always do this for advertorial videos to ensure that our clients are happy with the video before we release the final cut for you guys to watch on at home or wherever you may be. 
And would you look at that? Uploads are no problem thanks to the Intel Wi-Fi 6E technology. I'm also tinkering with the GOM and Gaming Hub so I can further optimize my system by turning off background processes to help make the Victor 16 even more efficient. I mean, it's already efficient as it is, but of course, we want to be even more efficient so you can get stuff done faster. Now you might be thinking the Omen Gaming Hub might just be for gaming, but that's not the case. It doesn't just improve gaming performance, but also efficiency overall. I definitely don't need to worry when it comes to meeting deadlines. Now for the final verdict. Did Victor 16 by HP pass the stress test? Absolutely. It helped me get my work done with ease. And best of all, I can do this anywhere as long as I have the laptop with me. Writing articles, catching up to the latest anime series made everything a lot more enjoyable. But not only did I get to work, I also got to play as well. I mean, I did finish my tasks ahead of time, so I deserve to unwind and play the latest games I'm addicted to, which is, in this case, then the Zone Zero. I mean, just don't tell Boss A. He's over there. Indeed, the Victor 16 by HP gives users the confidence to go anywhere, do anything with Intel Core i5 processor. Do check it out on Shopee and Lazada and see if this laptop is the one that can fulfill your multitasking needs. But what do you think of the new HP Victor 16? Is it the laptop you'll consider buying to be more productive? productive? Share your thoughts in the comments below. And of course, if you enjoyed this video, do drop a like and subscribe to watch more. And don't forget to follow us on our social media platforms, which is Facebook, Instagram, X, and TikTok. And of course, visit yugatech.com to stay updated with the latest tech news and reviews. Once again, this has been Jose, and I'll catch you guys next time. See ya, because I'm gonna go play some more games.